Yeah, he did. did. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, we're live here. We're live. All right, good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Town of Windsor November 10 board meeting. Before we get started, can we get everybody stand for the pledge, please? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic, which is stands one nation under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for all. All right, do my introductions. Uh, I've got the entire town board here to my right, Deputy Supervisor Steve Moreau, Councilwoman Sylvia Santiago. To my left is Councilwoman Eve Lincoln, Councilwoman Carly Bro. My immediate right is the town clerk, Mr. Carino. It's on here. I have a highway superintendent, Anthony Fio, Deputy Chief Brian Hollyfield, Town Attorney Dave Zagon, and the audience. We have the receiver of taxes, Susan Machaibo. And we also have with us our wonderful birthday controller during Casey. Happy birthday to you. We're not going to talk about your age anymore. <laughs> Uh, okay, so the first item on the agenda is the public hearing uh, to adopt the 2025 preliminary budget. Um, doesn't think we have many folks here, but I do. Um, I do want to just start off with saying thank you to um, Doreen, all the work you put into it. Obviously, each year, um, I know it's a, it's a long and tedious process. Um, the town board too it was very interactive and involved in this. Um, it was definitely a, a you know challenging one, and I say challenging one because we, um, you know, we're one of the few, maybe three, four uh, towns at least in Orange County that has remained under the tax cap, with the use of uh, some reserves. Um, we're confident that at the end of the year we're going to come out looking good. Um, however, um, I think we all know we've agreed that it's going to be tough to sustain the two percent tax cap. Um, you know, perhaps going forward, we're going to do our best. Our department has to do good you know, during the year to keep uh, keep us within the budgets and everything. So I appreciate that, and I appreciate all the work we've done on and everything. Um, and I was told, I guess you had to make a big speech and everything, or no? No, no I didn't tell you. Okay. okay. Um, yeah, the, uh, I, I think since we did so good, there, we weren't going to draw a big crowd today. So, um, but there anything on there, Justin? Anybody there? Two people in the audience. One's elected. Alberto, nothing. You're all good. You got all the info, right? You need something exciting. All right, we're going to move on with this. Um, town board, town New Windsor, closed the public hearing regarding the preliminary budget, town budget for the year 2025. Motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Grubb. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yeah. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Grubb. Yes. Supervisor. Yes. Town board, town New Windsor hereby adopted the 2025 preliminary town budget at the annual budget. For the town of Windsor for the fiscal year beginning the first day of January 2025, that the town clerk enter the 2025 annual budget in detail in the minutes of the meeting and advertise the same as required by law. That the town clerk and the town supervisor certified and distributed the 2025 annual budget pursuant to New York State Town Law 115 and 202A, all in accordance with the resolution attached here to the motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Grubb. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Yes. Councilman Yes. Yes. Again, thank you to everybody involved to make this possible. Uh, fine job by all. So I'm going to take a half a minute break and tell Dorian to leave. It's your birthday. There'll be some dinner plans, so head out. You're good. You're okay. You can grab your, your paperwork there, and I appreciate it. Thank you for everything. Happy birthday. Thank you, Dorian. All right now, I'll open a public hearing. Uh, proposed local law amending chapter. Uh, amend uh, chapter 280 to town code town New Windsor vehicle and traffic, no parking on certain streets, Walnut Street, Willow Parkway, Carly Lane, Avenue of America, and Square Hill Road. Assuming this is going to be just like the rest of it, it's not done, right? I think nobody else actually lost one of the other ones. Nothing nobody on there, Dustin? All right. Town Board Town New Windsor closed the public hearing concerning the adoption of local law to amend Chapter 280 of the Town Code of Town New Windsor entitled Vehicle and Traffic to clarify the area of prohibited 
parking on Walnut Street, Willow Parkway, Friday Lane, Avenues of America, and Square Hill Road. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Bro. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Rojas. Yes. Yes. Oh, I'll talk to this in a minute. Uh, town board found new ones are pursuant to section 10 and 11 of the missile home rule hereby adopt the attached local law amending chapter 280 of the town code town new ones are entitled vehicle and traffic to clarify the area of prohibited parking on walnut street willow parkway Friday lane avenue of americas and square hill road and direct the town clerk to publish pursuant to law motion move second roll call councilman bro yes councilman lincoln yes Councilman Yes. Councilman Yes. Supervisor Yes. Um, I want to thank the police department. See if you can thank you for all the work that you guys did on this, uh, investigating it. Um, I know there was a couple. Uh, I know the highway department had some concerns. My office did. The police department. Um, and I'm pretty certain that once Anthony gets this, these guys will have these poles up in no time because they're quick to act when it comes to this stuff. Thank you for that. Uh, public comments. Three minutes on any agenda items. Big item. Alberto, no, nothing. Buy you today, like that. Get me in the paper, right? <laughs> town board ten. You to hereby approve the minutes of the regular town board meeting held on October second, two thousand twenty-four, and the minutes of the special town board meeting held on October sixteenth, two thousand twenty-four, all as per the copies posted in the town clerk's bulletin board. The town hall and same distributed to each of the town board members. Motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Bro. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Mara. Yes. Supervisor today. Yes. Here are no objection. Town board time new ones are pursuant to the resolution annex here to hereby amend the rates of the 2025 year contained in an agreement dated December 8, 2023 between the town of New Windsor and KML Pollution Control Incorporated for the management and supervision, operation, and maintenance of the town of New Windsor's waste or water treatment facility and distribution system. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brough. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brough. Yes. Supervisor Yes, you'll hear a little more about this. They're going to have another one, but KML is our water um, and wastewater treatment plant sewer operators, and they do very good by us. We like KML. Um, they've been great for us. And, Thank uh, Mike Trumper and John Geo for all, all the stuff that we do here for New England. Town Board Town New England hereby authorize the town supervisor to execute the attached letter agreement between Town of New England and the Town of Newburgh for the sharing of one Town of New England's trailer mounted Godwin bypass pump on a temporary as needed basis. The only cost for the same shall be Newburgh's reimbursement to New England for the actual cost of servicing and, uh, and said Godwin bypass pump prior to. It being placed in service by Newburgh during the time that Delaware Aqueduct is offline. Said agreement is effective until December 31st, 2025. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brough. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Yes. Councilman Brough. Yes. Supervisor Clay. Yes. This is, uh, we do have a sharing agreement with the um, town of Newburgh now with valve exercising equipment and generators. And since the aqueduct shut, shut down and we provide them water, they are looking to borrow this pump so we can do this agreement. So. To help our neighbors out. Receive file. Uh, hearing no objection, Town Board 10 New Windsor received file with the town clerk. The attached task order number 24 05 with MHE Engineering DPC for engineering services related to Riley Road erosion control plans. Something that's done last month. <coughs> hearing no objection, Town Board 10 New Windsor pursuant to the resolution annex here to hereby amend the rates for the 2025 year. Contained in an agreement dated December 7, 2023, between the town of New Windsor and KML Pollution Control for, for management, supervision, operation, maintenance for the town of New Windsor's wastewater treatment. So, motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brough. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brown. Yes. Supervisor today. Yes. This is um, the sewer plant, which is going to be getting a little more challenging as we upgrade it and make it new with that. So, and then KML could have service uh, New Windsor. Town Board Town New are hereby authorized the supervisor to execute a community development block grant disaster recovery agreement between the Town of New Windsor and County of Orange and any other documents necessary to facilitate said grant for the Seizures Lane Wastewater Treatment Facility expansion phase number one. Motion? Moved. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brown. Yes. Supervisor today. Yes. This is a um a grant that we do with them with the county. We got for about six million dollars to do. Uh, phase one, which is a control building that was damaged during Hurricane Irene. We're still dealing with Hurricane Irene money, but we'll take it. Um, and that's going up to bid soon, and we'll be officially underway with this new plan. 
Town Board Town Newman to authorize the town clerk to advertise pursuant to law calling for sealed bids for a tree clearing project at the Seasons Lane Wastewater Treatment Facility, which shall be received and publicly open on the 26th day of November 2024, 11 a.m. local time at the office of the Town New Windsor Town Clerk, 555 Union Avenue, New Windsor, New York. The Town Board of Town New Windsor reserves the right to reject any and all bids. Motion? Move. Second. Roll. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrow. Yes. Supervisor Dead. Yes, this is the for this control building and the rest of the work that's there. We have to clear some trees and property that was uh, uh uh, alienated for this whole project here for us. Town Board 10 New Windsor authorizes the town clerk to advertise pursuant to law calling for sealed bids for Caesars Lane wastewater treatment plant expansion phase one, uh, which shall be received and publicly open on the 23rd day of January 2025 at 11 a.m. local time at the office of Town New Windsor Town Clerk 555 Union Avenue, New Windsor, New York. The Town Board 10 New Windsor reserves the right to reject any and all bids. Motion? Moved. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morales. Yes. Yes. This is again that phase one control building that's being paid for grant money and then hurricane relief money. Uh, and, um, you're going to the next couple of years here upwards to 500 motions. This <laughs> sewer plan. So, um, again, like credit to the. Town Board Town New Windsor introduced the attached proposed local law call for the public hearing regarding said proposed local law to repeal and rescind local law number three, 2024, to override the tax levy limit to establish in general municipal law section 3C to be held on December 4, 2024, at 7 p.m. in person at Town Hall 555 Union Avenue, New Windsor, New York, pursuant to law in accordance with the resolution annexed here to motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Lincoln. Yes. 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 Again, thank you to everybody involved in that. We were able to once again override that. To stay under the two percent tax gap. Once again. Town Board Town New are hereby introduced a local law to amend Chapter Two Sixty Three, Article Three of the Town Code Town New to provide a partial tax exemption exemption on the assessment of real property owned by qualifying volunteer firefighters, volunteer ambulance personnel, and their qualifying spouses residing in the Town New Windsor. Pursuant to New York State Real Property Tax Law 466A, declare this matter a Type 2 action pursuant to the State Environmental Quality Review Act for a public hearing to be set December 4, 2024 at 7 p.m. The Town Hall 555 Union Avenue, New Engineer, and authorize the town clerk to advertise the same pursuant to law by publication and posting on all its correspondence and resolution annexed here to. Motion? Right. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. 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 This is um, we actually have the tax exemption now. This law is going to replace, uh, repeal and replace the old one. This is actually a two percent, or um, a true ten percent tax uh, relief for the volunteer fire department and ambulance corps. This also does go towards the school taxes of those school districts. We have three of them: Washington, Newburgh, and Cornwall, and New Windsor. And if they uh, if they're involved in this program, you also get that tax relief as well. So I think the parents uh, office and also the um, sessions office for working on this and getting this done. There's going to be a public hearing next month on it, and we'll also get this paid. Town board tax new in accordance with the resolution the annex here to authorize a relevy on the town's 2025 tax roll for all unpaid fire inspection charges against property set forth in a statement of unpaid fire inspection charges, which filed. With the town clerk on October 30, 2024, and the amount which totals $11,375. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrell. Yes. Supervisor Debbie. Yes, this is a yearly thing. This number also fluctuates. I think this went up a little bit from last year. Um, the fire inspectors go out to their inspections, and folks just don't ignore the bill that goes on their taxes. Town Board Town New are pursuant to the attached resolution authorized a relevy on the town's 2025 tax roll for all unpaid water, sewer, and beaver dam garbage charges as set forth on the statement of properties and corresponding properties owners, which was filed in with the town clerk on November 1st, 2024, and transmitted to the town supervisor to the town board on November 1st, 2024, the amount of such unpaid water, sewer, and beaver dam garbage charges to be relevied, totaling 1,023,554.14. Motion? Yeah. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrow. Yes. Supervisor Debbie. Yes. This too actually has gone up. Uh, last year, I believe it was like around 966,000. So you're shaking your head. Yes. And it's gone up a bit. Again, we made whole on these by 
for levying them under taxes. Hearing no objection, Town Board Ted Newinger, pursuant to the resolution annexed here to shall retain the engineering firm MIT Engineering DPC with the offices located at 33 Airport Center Drive, Suite 202, New Windsor, New York, the engineering for the town of for the year of 2025 and further authorize the supervisor to execute the attachment amendment to owner engineer agreement for engineering services between the town of New Windsor and MIT Engineering DPC, which outlines the terms, conditions, and fees for the services to be performed during the year of 2025. Motion? Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brown. Yes. Supervisor yes. This is, um, we do this yearly with uh, MHA. Um, again, we're signing them up for another year. They do a, a fine job for New Windsor. Um, I appreciate their services to us. Town Board Town Newins are hereby amended 2024 standard schedule of fees as follows. Cemetery fees, disinterment. Disinterment of remains $800. Disinterment and reinterment with cemetery in concrete vault 2100. Disinterment and reinterment within cemetery without concrete vault 2500. Disinterment to another cemetery in concrete vault 2000. And disinterment to another cemetery without concrete vault 2500. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. 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 We've done this is the second one we've done, and uh, at the recommendation of a local funeral guy, he said that we probably should increase our fees or the lowest our end, and it's a lot of work to do. So we appreciate them, and we did. Town board town you are hereby authorize the supervisor to execute the attached proposal with control point associated in incorporated PT in the amount of thirty four thousand eight hundred ninety five dollars plus the cost of reimbursables. For boundary and topographical survey and identification of the limits of wetlands as flagged by others at Christie Babcock Memorial Park in accordance with the recommendation of MHE Engineering dated 29th October 2024, annexed here to motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrow. Yes. Supervisor. Yes. This is um, this is uh, for the future expansion of Christie Babcock Park. We did get some. Pretty good news in reference to the wetland. They're not disturbing some of our bigger plans for there. So we we'll thank them. Let me see if we can have the whole rolling for us. <clears throat> town Board 10 in accordance with the resolution annex here too. And after its review of the attached materials, hereby approved piggybacking upon Westchester County New York contract number 5892 BPS for licensing, maintenance, and on site training for integrated parcel management software as service SAAS program. Approve the attached proposal from ICC Community Development Solutions, ICC CDS, regarding same, and authorize the town supervisor to execute their purchase order and any of all other documents necessary to enter in such agreement with ICC CDS, all of which are in connection with the Municipal Integrated Parcel Management SAAS project. The total first year cost of which shall not exceed $50,545. Motion? No. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrow. Yes. Supervisor. Yes. This is um, the IT department work on this. Um, it's for uh, a program for the building and fire inspectors to work together to choose this one. Uh, this is actually being paid for with uh, the remainder of uh, the and it just it's about a nine thousand dollar a year uh, cost to run it. Thank you. Thank you. To hear my authorized supervisor to execute. The attached agreement with absolute auctions and realty incorporated for the auction and sale surplus town owned vehicles at no cost to the town. AR sole compensation shall be percentages the amount of any bids paid to each item sold at auction, commonly known as a buyer's premium, which are to be paid by the buyer at the time of the auction. Motion? Move. Second. Roll. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morrell. Yes. Supervisor Fidetti. Yes. This is a, um, we're just executing this contract. With, uh, we're going to try to now sell our surplus to either vehicles or equipment by contracting with this company to come in and take pictures and advertise it, put it up, sell it for us, and hopefully get premium money for it. Town Board County with the authorized supervisor to execute the attached street lighting authority order for street lights to be located on station road. Motion? Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Brock. Yes. 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 There's Station Road with the exception of two, maybe two lights at intersections. There's a dark road there that's been on there for a long time. I went out there with Central Hudson. We identified seven different poles that we're going to uh, put some lights on there to kind of light that road up a little. 
Town Board Town Newman's are pursuant to the Town Law Section 271 hereby reappoint Harry Ferguson, 33 Springbrook Road, Newman's in New York, 12553 to the Town Newman's of Planning Board. Term shall commence January 1st, 2025 and expire on December 31st, 2030. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Grove. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Murrow. Yes. Supervisor Cadet. Yes. I'd like to thank Harry for agreeing to come back on um, and for all his work he does on the Planning Board. He's been on the Planning Board for 15 years now. So that's been a long time for Harry to be on there. And he's, uh, he runs the meetings when the chair is not not able to make it. So thank you, Harry, for your service there. <clears throat> town Board Town Newman's are pursuant to Town Newman's of Town Code Section 383.1C1. Hereby reappoint James R. Smith, 66 Hutchins Drive, Newman's in New York, 253, as the alt is in the Town Board Planning Board. Term shall commence January 1st, 2025, and expire on December 31st, 2030. Motion. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brown. Yep. Supervisor Bidet. Yes. I'd like to thank Jimmy too for his uh, efforts and his time there. He's he's been on there for one year. We appointed him one year last time. Gave him a little test drive. He, they liked him. He worked out for him. So you're going to keep him on for another five years. So thank you. Town Board Town New Windsor, pursuant to the New York State Town Law, Section 267, reappoint him uh, as a member of the Zoning Board of Appeals, George Rodriguez, 6 Brandon Court, New Windsor, New York, 12553. Term shall commence January 1st, 2025, and expire on December 31st, 2030. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Brown. Yes. Supervisor Cadet. Yes. Councilman Murrow. Yes. yes. Councilman yes. Councilman yes. I'd also like to thank George for his service. George is actually the chairman of our Zoning Board. He moved up to the ranks quick. Um, he's been there for five years now, and we're going to appoint him for another five years. So thanks there, George. <clears throat> town Board Town News are pursuant to New York State Town Law Section 267, reappoint the Zoning Board of Appeals, Susan M. Sweeney, 72 Hudson Drive. New Windsor, New York, 12553. Term shall commence January 1st, 2025, and expire on December 31st, 2030. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Morales. Yes. Yes. I'd like to thank Suzanne too. She's been on the uh, zoning board for five years as well. So thank you for her service. Brings a lot of knowledge to that board. Here, no objection. Town board town new to receive and file with the town clerk a letter of resignation submitted by Jeffrey Barrett dated November 4, 2024, resigning his appointment as a civilian member of the Bureau of Fire Prevention effective immediately. That's a receiving file. So Jeff um, works at my office um, for plan emergency planning. He's my safety officer and, and does a bunch of other things. He's on the fire advisory board and a couple of times he had a vote on some things he abstained. He felt there was a little bit of a um, conflict with him being in my office on the board. So he admirably stepped aside to let us appoint his next fellow. Town Board 10 New Jersey appoint John J. Seymour as a civilian member to the Bureau of Fire Prevention to fill the unexpired term of Jeff Byer, who tendered his resignation on November 4, 2024, and for a three year term. Said term shall commence immediately, run consecutively, and expire December 31st, 2027. Motion? Move. Second. Move. Councilman Brown. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Monroe. Yes. 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 And previously, like, I'd like to thank. I did want to thank Jeff for his service. He's been he on there for a while. And thank Johnny Seymour for agreeing to come on. John was actually a volunteer fireman. He does uh, EMS now and stuff. So we appreciate his uh, volunteering to come on that board here for us. Town Board Town of New Windsor hereby authorizes the town supervisor to execute a confidential settlement agreement in the matter of Patricia Tarshio versus the town of New Windsor at all. Index number 24 CV 01220. Motion? Vote. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yeah. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Murrow. Yes. Supervisor Cadet. Yes. Town Board 10 New Windsor grant and authorize a real property tax exemption pursuant to real property tax law section 4063 for the year 2025 to the village of Cornwall and the Hudson for its property located at 259 Riley Road, New Windsor, and further identify the town of New Windsor tax map as section 65, block one, lot 20. And this is a motion to grant their relief. Motion? Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brown. No. Councilman Lincoln. No. Councilman Santiago. No. Councilman Moreau. No. Supervisor Pedetti. No. Receive and file hearing no objection. Town Board 10 new ones are hereby receive and file with the town clerk the attached inspection and report regarding the condition of 210 Walsh Avenue, New Engineer, 12553, further identified on the town of New Engineer tax map of section 13, block 1, lot 1.2, and known by the state of Anna Masti. 
this is a building that the um, that we identified as uh, I know the police department was down there a few times. It's uh, it's unsecured, and we're going to try to get it secured. So we have to go through this process to do this. Hearing no objections, town board town was hereby receiving file with the town clerk and attached stormwater management facility easement and maintenance agreement dated September 17, 2024, between New Windsor Solar Holding LLC and the town of New Windsor for long term maintenance and continuation of private stormwater management facility for a project commonly known as 108 Windsor Highway Solar Farm, planning board 21 13 located upon 108 Windsor Highway, New Windsor, New York, and further identified the town of New Windsor tax map section 9, block 1, lot 3, and 17. Receiving file. And that's starting to get old. Up. Hearing no objection, town board town to hereby receiving file from the tax clerk the attached executed proposal with ERS consultants incorporated dated October 3rd, 2024 for wetland field delineation at Christie Babcock Memorial Park. Touched on that already. Received file, receiving file hearing no objection, town board town to hereby receiving file with the town clerk the attached executed proposal number 5641-2 with Mercurio Norton Tiroli Marshall dated October 3rd, 2024 for land surveying service for Rochetti Park. That's for the future uh, splash pad there and uh, at the park that we've had in Union Avenue. Hearing no objection, town board town to hereby receive and file with the town clerk the attached fully executed agreement with ICC Community Development Solutions dated October 3rd, 2024 for a license agreement for laser fish SAAS cloud based document storage. I think last month authorized. See for hearing no objection, town board town to receive and file with the Tax fully executed intermissile agreement dated October 16, 2024, between the Town New Windsor and Orange Lake Fire District for the purpose of utilizing the Town New Windsor information technology officers to assist the Orange Lake Fire District on as need basis in the uh, establishment, configuration, maintenance, and oversight of the Orange Lake Fire District computer servers, uh, perennials, network infrastructure, and hardware, geographic information services, radio communications, telecommunication technology, Microsoft 365, and website. You actually get a statement for that now, right? so much of it. Uh, hearing no objection, town board town New Windsor receiving file with the town clerk, the attached agreement dated the 10th day of October 2024 between the New York State's Governor Traffic Safety Committee and the town of New Windsor for a period commencing October 1st, 2024, and terminating this September 30, 2024 for police traffic services. Hearing no objection, town board town New Windsor. Receiving file with the town clerk, the attached kennel agreement dated October 15, 2024, between the town of New Windsor and the town of Cornwall for a temporary impoundment of town of Cornwall dogs at the town of New Windsor kennels facility during the evening hours and periods of cold weather. Said agreement shall expire October 15, 2025. Hearing no objection, town board town of New Windsor receiving file, the attached agreement dated October 2024, between the town of New Windsor and Richard Cole for nuisance wildlife control at the New Windsor landfill commencing January 1st, 2025, expiring December 31st, 2025. Receive and for hearing no objection, town board. Town New Windsor receiving file with the town clerk. They attach monthly reports for the following departments of October, all well, month of October, 2024. Judge Calderon, Judge Myers, Judge Clarino, Police Department, Building Department, Recreation Department, Tax Receivers, Utility Report, Town Clerk, New Windsor Emergency Medical Services. At this point, I'll open it up to the public. Alberto, no. Um, anything from the board? Anything we got anything? No, we're all good. Uh, the other thing I do want to just really quickly say and just get it out there now, um, and then not, I mean, it's probably coming weeks you might hear about um, consumption and water issues in town. There's going to be, you know, with no rain going on, or we may just put out a notice that we want people to. Uh, Watch their water consumption because it's becoming a quite a problem in New York City, um, everywhere around here. So uh, I know pretty soon as soon as I put as soon as they put out a notice, it's going to probably start pouring. But that's a, I guess a good thing. Uh, but please, uh, if you are listening, please try to concern as much as you can. Nothing else. The town board time notes are adjourned. Adjourn the town board meeting at seven twenty nine. Move. Second. Roll call. Councilman Brock. Yes. Councilman Lincoln. Yes. Councilman Santiago. Yes. Councilman Murrow. Yes. Yes. Okay.